Welcome to another rapid little walkthrough. I'm back at it with Hogwarts Legacy. Before I got into it, I did want to say thank you to everyone who has tuned in. Appreciate all of the support. And let's get into it. Are you alright? Don't you know who I am? Zenobia Noak. The girl whom everyone at school hates for no reason. Go to the second one to see what happens. Everyone hates you? Why? Because Hogwarts is full of bullies and spoil sports. Leander Pruitt's one of the worst, that no talent moon mind. I wanted to make some new friends, and so I brought my collection down to the common room. My gobstone collection, that is. I was hoping someone would want to play. Are you familiar with gobstones? Little balls, like marbles. Grand game. And if you lose, they spray you with a foul smelling liquid. Let's go with the first one. Gobstones. Sounds like a fun challenge. That's what I tried to tell everyone. <sighs> People can be so cruel. Just because they're sprayed all over with smelly gobstone spit, it's their own fault for losing. Imelda is one of the worst losers. Ever written a story or a terrible as well. And now those poor losers have taken my gobstones and hidden them in very high places all over the school. Let's go with the first one. Oh, rather an overreaction on their part. I'll say. Anyway, I can't work out how to get them back on my own. I don't think I know the necessary spells yet. I need someone, perhaps a selfless and talented fifth year to help me. Let's run through the questions. Do you have any suggestions on how to get your gobstones down from their hiding spots? If I knew that, I'd get them myself. Whoever hid my gobstones that high, Got up there somehow. Haven't you any friends at school? Not really. Natty said hello once, but not a word since. Jeez. I'll see what I can do. I'd appreciate the help. If you do find all of my gobstones, do come and see me again. I'll be back to playing Snake Pit and Jackstone by myself in no time. All right, let's find Zenobia's gobstones. Doesn't seem like it's going to be too difficult to do. Just got to look around. Better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. See, the first one's over here somewhere. There it goes. Oh, that's one of Zenobia's gobstones. I hardly see what all the fuss is about. Nice. So this is my second playthrough i'll be doing a lot of the side quest and a lot of the additional missions that i didn't do the first time around on here it's gonna be spoiler free compared to my entire series so feel free to check this out simultaneously it's not gonna really interfere with the long-term series of my first playthrough but this character it is a part of the slithering house so it is a little bit different in terms of the story from the first character that i made who was ravenclaw Let's see if i can get a better angle nice on to the next one There it is. Nice. Should only be a few more left.
in the Ravenclaw Tower. Here we go. Let's keep it moving. like there's one more that's also around here somewhere there we go nice get back to Zenobia hope you've had more luck than I did tracking down my gobstones hello Zenobia I found all of your gobstones really I didn't think it was possible however did you do it Common sense and basic magic. Well, <clears throat> may I have my gobstones back? So you do have the option to keep them. I'll give it back to her, though. Of course. They are yours, after all. Oh, how wonderful. I shall dedicate all of my future victories to you. Speaking of which, now that I have all my gobstones back, I wonder if anyone in the common room would be up for a game. That does sound like a terrible idea, but I'll go with the first one. I'm sure they'd be willing to play after the trouble spent getting them back. It's a fine idea. Isn't it? Oh, we'll have so much fun together laughing as all the losers get sprayed, which won't include me. Very well, off I go. Wish me luck. <laughs> nice, so I got a wand for the collection. But yeah, this is going to do it for this video. I'll be back with more side quests, tips, and tricks in the next one. I do want to say thank you for tuning in. Appreciate the love and support. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Spread the little. I'm out. Peace.